Oh yes, get back up. Oh, he wants another beating. Yes, he does. <laughs> hey, what's going on guys? Your boy Chosen Mighty here, and today I'm bringing you guys another episode of Jurassic World The Game. And today we are starting out on our beautiful Amargosaurus, and she is going to get to see more FaceTime today than she did last episode, and that's because today we are taking on Valkyrie 77, a boss which I have never fought, but am excited to fight. I actually haven't seen any uh, coverage on her like whatsoever the uh, the new boss, uh, but before we get into her, let's uh, clean up some house uh, We got a few things to do. Uh, don't worry. We're gonna get pretty much right into her. I just wanted to talk about one thing that I saw when I got on which uh, Was this we have aquatic plus packs and Cenozoic plus packs now I might or might not do a video on these um, I did do the legendary plus pack or a long time ago like uh, are these packs worth your money kind of thing And I might do that again with these but uh, before we do it. Let's just go ahead and look and see what we can get you can get any uh, Well not any but those are Cenozoic Oh, huh, that's weird Oh, well, it looks like you can get some Cenozoic and Aquatic um, uh, Tournament Creatures. That's what I was, the word I was looking for. And then as you go down, they're Legendary, Super Rare. So you can get Super Rare. Is that the worst you can get? Or can you get Rares? Ooh, you can even get Rares on this. So that's a gamble for $50. Uh, but you do get, uh, you know, a decent amount of DNA. But let's see. I'm sorry about your ears. Uh, <laughs> but let's see what you can get from here. A bunch of just basically crap. Uh, you know, from right now, just looking at it, I'm gonna have to say no, it's not worth your money, but, you know, we still might do another video on it later. Uh, but before we get in there, uh, like I said, we just gotta do this. I'm, don't worry, I'm just picking up these for my DNA so you can see this. And, uh, I just need this video clip right here. Uh, and, you know, and this is me being a little bit lazy, but I do need that video clip of me picking up the DNA from the prize drop, uh, and looking at this. Uh, and it looks like, yeah, that's pretty good, so we're gonna proc straight into that. Oh wow, that's actually the most expensive I've ever seen it. That costs about three thousand total VIP points. That's ooh, that's pricey. But uh, yeah, I just had to pick that up for the uh, top five tips uh, video that I am working on. But as you can see, I am preparing and have prepped for Valkyrie seventy-seven. Uh, so let's go ahead, hatch all these. We're gonna level him up. We're gonna have two Anglodoguses at level twenty, and I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not even really sure. That's how Gaming Beaver pronounces it. I think I've said that before, uh, and he's practically like the god at this game, so, uh, I mean, I usually don't cross him on almost anything he says, so, uh, yes, this is an Ankylodocus. Oh, it's not Donkus. It's Ankylodocus. Ah, uh, is that how you say it? I'm just gonna keep saying Ankylodocus. It, it's, it's a nice, he's got a nice ring to the tongue. So, yeah, we'll have these two at level 30, which means we can afford to get a level 41, but we won't today. So, yeah, let's go ahead and evolve these. Oh, first try, Lydia knows I'm recording, it has to, there's no other way. Uh, but yeah, we're not gonna cheat on this one, we're just gonna play our best cards. Uh, so we'll play Ankylodocus, uh, with Amargosaurus, and that is gonna be our team. Uh, and we're just gonna go in with Amargosaurus first, you're not even gonna get to see her do too much. Oh, first try again! Th seriously, Lydia knows I'm recording, that's the only way. Uh, but, uh, yeah, we're just gonna go with our best team, foot forward. So we'll start with Amargosaurus first. Oh, not first try. But we'll start with the Margosaurus first. Uh, just use her as a meat shield, so she's not even going to get that much face time. But... And then we're going to go in with the two Ankylodonkis is second. And that, yeah, that's our best team right there. Uh, now, oop, get off my screen. Ankylodonkis... Oh, get off my screen. Uh, Ankylodonkis doesn't have the greatest health, but the attack is awesome. Uh, and I don't even know if I fought one of these at level 30, but let's... Uh, Oh, she's beautiful. I love her. I love her. So let's go back. Let's see where that puts her at in the rankings. Uh, I'm sure it's going to be pretty high. Also, we're going to take on back, uh, Baculites. I think that's how you say it. We're going to take on Baculites next episode. But today, this is all we're going to be doing. We're going to be fighting Valkyrie 77. Uh, so that put her at my fourth best creature. Uh, below a level 30 Endom and a level 20 Ospisaurus. Ospisaurus is so good, but a little bit pricey, but you know, that's what you expect. So, let's go get a Margosaurus. Ooh. A Margosaurus isn't even our best. Okay, so we're not going to be putting in a Margosaurus as the meat show. We're going to be putting in a... Yeah, might as well. And then we'll finish out with our two Ankylodonchus. Now, I've never seen any of the animations for Valkyrie 77, so this is going to be all new to me. Oh, wow. This is going to be amazing. I love the way that this uh, whole battle arena is set up, too. Only 98 attack. Wow, that's kind of sad. <laughs> that's really sad, actually. I, actually, I'm pretty sure my best team would have been uh, to put in Indominus in. Because I think he has over 1,000 attack, but, you know. Oh, well. 
And he has 3,000 health. I probably should have put Indominus in, but at least we nerfed the attack here, so that's all we're really looking for. Uh, hopefully she goes all out five. Not going to attack yet, okay. Uh, but we're gonna go full four and four. Now I have kind of switched up my battle strategy whenever I play a boss like this, because they play differently. They play more strategically, so you can't just do the full on uh, reserve and full on attack strategies yeah so she might she would have done a lot of damage she might have even killed me oh no oh hardly any damage all right yeah we're gonna kill her uh or he i like i said we don't assume genders here on Jurassic world <laughs> i'm not really sure they never specify the the sex of these creatures oh yes get back up oh he wants another beating yes he does <laughs> or she damn it <laughs> I, I, that's never gonna be uh, resolved for me. Okay, we're just gonna go full on four and full on four. Uh, yeah, two block. I mean, that's no problem. 2,000 attack. Really, I do a ton of damage. And this kind of... I figured this would happen. They put out a, a herbivore in the tournament. I'm like, well, they're obviously gonna come out with a boss. They're gonna bring back Valkyrie so you can fight with the new creature you got. Which is what I expected would happen, and it did. So, you know, it's not even really a surprise to me that Valkyrie is back. Okay, so what do we need? Oh my gosh, it still takes five attacks from an Ankylodocus. That's insane. But that's two lives out the way. And here comes the third. <laughs> I, love, I don't know how I'm going to do the thumbnail, but it's probably going to evolve that right there. That looked beautiful. Okay. Yeah, that killed me. 100% that killed me. Yeah, ouch. Alright, we're going to have to play this one way more strategically. Uh, we're gonna go for three block two three and four reserve Hopefully we can bait uh, Hopefully we can bait. Hopefully she goes for that. Oh I'm still not trusting that I'm pretty sure she She's gonna proc all those into reserve. She can kill me in One two. okay, so we're gonna go for Yeah, cuz that'll leave us with he hits me with three, I should live. Yeah, so that's exactly what I thought would happen. Okay, she went for six. She got one block. Oh, ouch. Uh, okay, so we can be killed in three. She's got one block. Oh, screw it. We might as well just go full out. I mean, we oh, we actually might have killed it. Let's see. Yes, awesome. <laughs> oh, well, that's probably the last level we're going to get her. That's not even that much. Oh, look at it. It's so beautiful. I really do. The bot like the model for this boss is just gorgeous. 42,000 health. Now, that would be a feat that I would be proud to take on. Let's look at this. Oh, that's gorgeous. The model on that thing is beautiful. It's just a pteranodon like 40k you know that's probably a lot more than i i did back in the day i think i did like 30k or something like that but you know that's pretty much gonna be it guys uh 441 dna now i might do this off screen some more but you know as you can see we still got 3 billion uh damage to to uh do to her until we get our boss statue and then we're gonna put that right here next to all our other bosses but that's gonna be in the episode guys and if you enjoyed be sure to hit the like button below comment rate subscribe do what you guys do and i'll see you guys in the next episode